Hey, checking in with you. Great question. I want to answer it in detail because it's so important that people get this right. It's not about giving up friends and revising instead. It's a balance. It's about doing both and figuring out at certain points in the year, there are times when you need to prioritize the books, hitting them hard, doing the revision over going out and partying with the friends or dividing your friend group a bit. Obviously not doing it publicly, just in your head thinking about, okay, who are the friends that are a bit more studious or a bit more switched on, want to do well in exams that I have, spend more time with them during exam season? Who are the ones that are a bit, you know, party goers, they like doing the other things that I like doing, whatever it is you like doing, it might not be partying, it could be fishing, anything, any kind of hobby or activity. Spend time with them when exam season perhaps isn't as urgent. So as the terms progress, you want to be prioritizing those more studious friends. It's fine to have loads of different types of friends as well and prioritize the time you spend with them depending on what's important to you at the moment or what the priorities are. That's cool. I'd say the way to execute it and actually do it, because that's the hard bit, right? Like, do you have a conversation with your friends? Do you just behave in a certain way and just let things run its course? I'd recommend you just behave in a certain way. So in the non-exam terms, you double down on the other stuff you like doing. In the exam term, you focus on your studious friends and other friends will pick up on it they'll be like oh, okay you're, you're doing that and that they'll probably just respect it as you know that's what is important to you so cool you do that and you'll find that a lot of people are actually very self-absorbed in that you don't notice what's going on with other people that much hope that was useful i'm checking out